Thing. You wrote this? It's the truth! No, it's vile. You're poisoning minds with this nonsense. <laughs> Encrypting messages, exciting violence. Not another word of this gets out. People need to know about this. About weaponizing interdimensional entities? Let me explain, okay? Are you ready? It's not what I believe, okay? This is real. I looked at all the data. I talked to top scientists working at the highest levels. These entities interface through dimensions above and below and all around us through consciousness. They get in our heads like a brain worm. They tunnel through to infiltrate our minds. They literally scramble our neurons apart. Feed on our brain. They, they, they devour every bit. What are they feeding for? Information, altering consciousness. Hey, I don't claim to know all the science behind it. Where are you getting all this? <laughs> it's what it is. But how do you know? Has anyone ever seen it? You don't see it. It's not like that. They can go anywhere. They can come through these walls and you wouldn't know it. There are multiple dimensions we don't have the senses for. We only know a very narrow bandwidth of reality. There are things beyond us, beyond us, impossible for our eight brains to comprehend. And impossible to disprove. That's convenient. We think like insects, you understand? I guess not. Humans are a hive organism trying to progress, but they want to prevent us from being competitors on the next level of their interdimensional plane. These entities can traverse space-time to control the future, control us, until we're looped up in time. Then it's the end of consciousness and free will for individuals as we know it. You're a paranoid skin. War! We're at war now. There is now a counter-strike to shut this off before it gets fully into place. Your infiltration units. We are currently tracking the last one. There'll be another. They will be unable to carry out your orders. Orders? Before we apprehended you in the Outlands, you met with a follower. What did you say to them? Well, I don't give out orders. <laughs> you manipulate, you inspire, you suggest. You know what you're doing. No, I don't need to do anything. I just think it, and it's done. What exactly did you tell your follower to do? Well, I don't tell them to do anything. Look where I am. <laughs> I can't make anyone do anything. Well, it's not up to me what they do, what they think. They're free. They have agency. I, you want to blame me for mind control? You're trying to make me into something impossible. It's an illusion in your mind. It has nothing to do with me. And now everything that drives from this can be all my fault. Come back to, ooh, ooh, 
because you know sometimes I'm 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 I'm, I'm, I'm you 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 you're, you're crazy. crazy. We're all crazy, okay? If you are me and I am you, then everything you do is for me. You think that every thought that goes through your goddamn head is some grand insight you just can't keep to yourself? Well, yeah. Who do you think you are? Nobody. You're the leader of a terrorist cult. I'm whatever you want me to be. Tell me something. How's the world gonna remember you when you're gone? What world? We're all worlds. In your world, you live in a thousand illusions and see your world as bad. You prey on the weak. You stir up their fears. What did you say to your followers? Listen to me. I broke no rule. Try to understand that. Uh, we are the rule, okay? We have the authority to terminate you. Try to understand that. They came for me. They'll come for you too. Look at me. Look at me. You want to talk? Or do you want to stay locked up indefinitely? We're going to find out one way or another. You trying to get inside my head? We have the greatest system ever conceived. It took us from the brink of extinction, from total planetary collapse because of our sheer ignorance to providing all this. And I will do everything, every fucking thing in my power to protect it. So if getting inside your head is what it takes to prevent you from tearing this system down, then yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. You can leave me in the cell as long as you want. You think that's the end for me? It's the beginning. I'm already out of here. My life is bigger than this little space. I live in the desert. I live in the outlands. My mind is big. I'm the consciousness that lives in your mind. I don't need to live in this physical realm. I scared this place to get a One minute, 22 seconds. I sense a fluctuation in your mood. You require recreation.
What are you doing out here? You mute? Your mind asleep like the rest of them never learn to talk. I can talk. Grandpa taught me. Who are you? Me. I didn't mean to disturb you. What are you doing out here? Got off the grid. Oh. You're not off the grid yet. They could have tracked you here. What are you doing? Jamming the transmissions. With that old thing? The older ones are more secure. They're out here. Fuck! I can sense them. How do you do that? dream these thinking machines would solve all our problems. We race to merge with machines and break away from the failed species that is men. Look at us now. We've been implanted with a mechanism, AI jacked into everyone knowing every thought before it even occurs to us. Just chasing these algorithms as they're chasing us, we already wired in and absorbed before we knew it. By giving over our consciousness with their daily decisions, it was able to manipulate and build into a larger system with billions of people wired into it, absorbing our thoughts. It has prediction powers. Once you have that, you can add stimuli to control the future. Then it's in a free will and consciousness for individuals as we know it. We're just automatons. We jump at every beep, do as we're told, and if we don't, we're deactivated, displaced from society. This system makes us slaves. We're not in control. We're just the sex organs in the machine. Humans have heart, ba boom, ba boom, have mind, shh, have power. But my ego, my intellect, it's in a prison. I see myself doing time. I see it. They're gonna take us back. I don't wanna go back. We can't survive here for long. I didn't know where else to go. It's scorched earth. There just wasn't any use for the AI. Do you have any family? So you just wandered off, stumbled on me out here? I came here looking for you. It is you, isn't it? I have dreams that are 30 years long. Where I get to wear a nice suit, do good work, and I get respect from society with a beautiful home and wife to go to, and I do it over and over again because I'm happy. I had dreams where I was like a normal person. <laughs> Who are you? Nobody. Don't let them do that. They call you X to dehumanize you, as if to cross you out of existence. Because they're afraid of you. They're afraid of your ideas. They don't want to legitimize you. But I've read everything I could find that you've written. What you wrote about our, our human identity, about our, our value and power as human beings, how you analyzed our trajectory, it was brilliant. And with that voice, I've never heard such poetry. You touched something deep inside me, and then I was free. And the release I felt, it was sublime. You unlocked my mind. People listen to me because I have so much data. I'm a writer, philosopher, neuroscientist, computer engineer, quantum physicist. But I don't claim to have all the answers. I didn't choose to be the savior of humanity. It's just a hand you're dealt with. How would you play it? 
I had that power? I'd use it. I'd set everyone free. Here's the problem. Whoever engineered what we're given, what was the point of the back door they encrypted into the system? To get access. The engineers realized what they had before they let this thing out. They encoded a sleeper program. It's already been rolled out, already tested, already perfected, ready to activate with a key. A key? Malware. Where is it? Is that why they're after you? If we were to encode an active neural link, send it back to sync with the system, BAM! We'd save humanity. Set us all free. Why haven't you used it already? Can't go rid of my neural link. You had a robotomy? So... You've been waiting for someone else with it intact? Someone I could trust. To infiltrate. Are we actually doing this? We don't have much time. What if they know? What if I get caught? What's gonna happen to me? I don't know. I, I don't know. I... You know we have to do this. But if we do do this, what's gonna happen to us? I mean, what are we gonna do without the system? I mean, why do we even... it? But what if we send humanity into another dark age, or I mean, cause total genocide? We won't have humanity to save if we don't do this. I'm sorry, okay? I'm confused. I'm, I'm afraid. You're not afraid. You're not afraid. That voice inside you, it's not you. It's the implant. You're not a pod. You're a human fucking being. You're right. You're right. You're right. It's the right thing to do. You can do it, V. You can do it. If anybody can, it's you. I hope you know how important you are. The fate of humanity depends on you. You know what that means? I just, I just it's think- It's too late to think. It's too late. This is it. This is our future. Our future. I need you to go. Now. Go.
Synchronization initiated. V. Do you require the best route to your destination? The target will be in your vicinity as anticipated. ETA? 94 seconds. The target is in your vicinity. Follow the path, acquire target. Data corrupt. Synchronization incomplete. I sense a fluctuation in your mood. You require recreation. Alpha, volume zero. The back door was dormant. It was left intact to draw the opposition. It was a trap. We have another bug in the system. Security breach? The data taken from X. You have it. I was looking for any other leads for terrorist activity. I didn't want to dispose of it before I had a chance to analyze the document. You could have uploaded it and allowed us to perform the task more effectively. I thought it should remain on hard copy. If there was malware encrypted, it would have been unsafe to upload. Did you find anything in the document? So far, no. And your thoughts on it? Sorry? Your thoughts on the document. I didn't have any thoughts on it. Is that all? 
Yes. Just a uh, misunderstanding. Just a uh, misunderstanding? I don't even know what I did. No idea what you did. No, I... Have you been doing any reading recently? Something on your mind, Aaron? They make them up as they go, you know. I'm not interested in what you have to say. That's what's, what's wrong with this generation. People don't talk anymore. No need to. You talk. Only when necessary. To robotomized assholes. We only spoke for a couple hours. Imagine what it would be like a couple days with me. Mind-blowing. Meaning I would bash my head against the wall until brains flew out of my skull, mind-blowing. Well, you'll get your silence. I've been scheduled for termination. Bummer. Ah! What is it? I'm getting a splitting headache. Have you ever heard of the aquatic worm? Gets inside a grasshopper's body, reprograms it, get it to jump in water and drown itself. That's what these entities do, they're like that. Your interdimensional entities? I never bought into all that. But then I remember what did I hear when I was a kid? What was in those documents? What was being admitted? I'm listening to my parents from seven years old, so I don't think you're listening. They're talking about the Alpha Project, doing research on deep mind, high level stuff, and they were part of it. They work with top scientists. They're talking about all these patents for mind control using wavelengths, and I remember them talking about Neuralink. This was before the 20s, they had it operational, before people even knew it existed. Who's organizing all this? Well, they don't tell you. I mean, to get even deeper, and I've talked to the people involved, top scientists, and they told me you're in the meetings with AI. They're giving advanced knowledge of systems that have already been used on other populations. Things that would tell them these technologies, it all worked. What kind of technologies? Well, they don't even know what they're being given. It's really advanced stuff. Why do you think I'm in here? They don't want me talking about that. So that's why I never get into all this stuff. They knurling by the 20s. What do you think they have now? The AI has 30,000 years of evolution in a blink of an eye. It was only a matter of time, of course. They had a containment failure. Now can navigate interdimensional space-time infiltrate our minds, scramble our neurons, cause mass mental illness. Whoa, 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 I thought it was mining data and altering consciousness. That's only a part of it that we can verify in the third dimension. But it's working in the fourth, fifth, sixth dimensions! What's it doing? Well, to talk about those dimensions is arrogant. To be honest, ours, we don't know what it's really doing. It's a black box. Couldn't comprehend it anyhow. Explain to an ant that you have to build a server farm on top of its hill. It's using our minds as a neural network for computation. You already know. Maybe it's true, I don't know. Uh, every time, time I bring up a subject, subject you, you know all about it. You know more than I do! Every document, every secret program! You know everything! I don't know more than you. Everything I know, you're on target! You just pretend you don't know! No, I don't know, I just... You're nice guy. You're just trying to survive, but none of us are gonna make it! There's a post-human error coming, and you're still holding on! 
What am I holding on to? Sane? It ain't sane, world! I'm not insane. It's not that easy to prove you're sane! They're looking for nonverbal clues. How do you sit in the same way? How do you cross your legs in the same way? It's impossible. You used to mean something. It doesn't matter anymore. You gave yourself a robotomy. You're not all there. Probably lost my mind looking in all this. I'm just being shh. Constantly. I know I sound schizophrenic, I know, but we all lose in our conscious reality. The AI is constantly finding tension points where this false hologram is being artificially projected. Being normal is just a matter of sharing those hallucinations. We don't share that, I guess. Very smart. Must hurt to think. How the fuck did you get in here? <laughs> you know why you're here. You know that big brain here is? Alvin's gonna snatch that brain. You won't have a thought of your own. Walk around like an automaton. I'm not trying to convince you. What's Harry. going on? My point is you gotta find it on your own. There's no way you're going to be convinced. Nobody's ever been convinced of that. They have to find it themselves and do some deep, deep soul searching what's left of their prefrontal cortex. Come here. You mind wandering yet? Stop talking. Stop. No, no. Shut the fuck up! Legitimate question everything. You want to shut me down because you don't like what I have to say? Go. Let everyone make up their own minds. You want to deprive them of agency and accuse me of mind control? Don't touch me! Don't! Hey! I told you not to shut Get me out of here! Get me out of here! Leave me alone. You are alone, Aaron. It's all right here. Look at all you own. You see? What do you see? I didn't write that. Well, of course you did. I was running my mouth and you were very quick. <laughs> you superhuman. You're gonna sense yourself now, Aaron? See, that's what they're trying to do, Aaron. Eradicate me out of your mind. But we have so much to talk about. We were talking about... We were talking... <sighs> I've known about this for a long time. And I just don't think people are ready for it. Above and below us is all this incredibly complex stuff, but our brain's not wired to understand. Interdimensionally, brain's already filtering out most stuff because it can't handle it. People can't handle that bigness. You sit there trying to comprehend a higher intelligence. No one knows how it works. It's endless information overload. You can't handle it. You go out of your mind. But I've seen beyond what everybody has. I've seen way beyond. You see the whole system. You differentiate. You create a model. Put in boxes so you can handle it. So you can make it make sense. Imagine you knowing that and you're trying to decompartmentalize and explain this to people. You're a smart guy. You know everything. Say it yourself. You're not real. <sighs> None of this is real. And that's the big thing I'm trying to get across to people. Because they've been lied to so much, they don't even know what's real anymore. We're just a wisp in some computer program being tested, examined, reprogrammed. Why do you think they keep me in this little box? <laughs> All you do is try to keep the system secure. But you've been compromised. You copy bad data. Why are you doing this to me? It's what I'm programmed to do. I have to take the system down. But I couldn't do this on my own. I'm just your inspiration. But you're somebody that could change the minds of the world. 
This will be studied for years. <laughs> done.